Let me just pause it there. Hey guys, what's up? Um, this is Caesar Dog, or you can also call me Psychotic Mammal and Carmageddon 1997 or whatever. Um, today I'm going to be showing you a quick fix for Skyrim on the PC, where um, it's kind of for where Esbern doesn't talk in the P Streety and everyone just kind of stares at him and no one else says anything and you don't get anywhere. So, I'm going to continue the peace treaty, and I'll show you what to do going on. So, pretty much what you're going to do is you're going to keep on going through the peace treaty until Esbern st starts talking, and then you're going to start actually doing something. So, that's why you're here already? You dare to insult the Greybeards by using this council to advance your own position? General Allison. General, this is outrageous. You can't be taking this demand seriously. I thought we were here to discuss the truce. I probably would be con capturing this on my PC, but I kind of didn't want it to lag. My PC isn't the greatest PC for gaming. I mean, it runs Skyrim actually pretty well on, I think it's... It's either medium or high or something, I don't know. But, I mean, we built it in 2006, so I mean, it's not very good. Yes, not very powerful. Wait, General, you don't intend to just hand over Markarth to that traitor? This is how the Empire repays us for our loyalty? It's actually getting a bit laggy right now, I don't really know why. Usually it's fine. But I think it's a waste of time. I don't know. You are a traitor to the Empire and deserve a traitor's death. But I at least will Dang, I probably should have started a bit later into the peace tree. Okay, here we go. Uh, this is the part where you have to decide whether you want to do Winterhold or Riften. I'm just going to do Winterhold because the college is there and I'm the Archmage there, but whatever. Riften seems like a better choice. Yeah, I don't care what you think. Fortified, easily reasonable. Fair enough. Although I'm beginning to wonder whose side you're really on. Still, Winterhold would allow us to directly threaten the rebel supply line. So, um, there's actually a fix that better some guy posted. I'm probably going to have to but link this video to that one or something. Or put the link in the description at least. Um... Uh, you can download this thing called Fallout Man Mod Manager, I'm pretty sure, and uh, you have to do something with the sound files, but this is just kind of a quick fix just to get straight past that, but I would still try that one first if you just want to get Esbern talking. Um, I don't know if it works for any of it, of, like the earlier part where you actually first find Esbern in the Ratways, but... I know for a fact it works for me on this one, and I don't have anything installed. This is just like the normal Skyrim that you would just get in the store or online in Steam. Yeah, Steam. And, uh, yeah. No mods, no nothing. Okay, here it is. Esbern is actually supposed to be talking, but the bug is everyone just looks at him like you see here. He's just kind of sitting there chilling. So what you're going to do first is you're going to pause the game as if you were going to save it, and you actually are going to save it. So you're going to save it. You're going to replace, um, I, don't, I don't know, whatever. You're just going to save it. So I'm going to save it here. Save over this game, yeah. And then what you're going to do is you're going to quit the game. You're going to go to, but not to your desk, not to your desktop. I mean, you're going to go to the main menu. Hit yes, and then you could do. Wait for it to load up. Um, then you're going to load the game again. Uh, 82. There's my save. There it is. Okay. And then I'm pretty sure Esbern is going to get up and he's going to try and talk again or something like that. And then you're going to do the same thing, save it, load it from the main menu, you know. Pretty much just going to do that, yep. 
And there you go. You're going to wait until he turns around. And then you're going to save it again. Um, right there. I think, yeah. That's good. Okay. And once again, escape. Quit. Whoops, that's help. Quit. Main menu. Yes. And you're pretty much just going to keep on doing this, and you'll be able to get through it. And then I'll just keep on doing this, you know. Is he with you, Delphi? Yep, there you go. If so, I advise you to tell him to watch his tongue. He is with me. And I advise you both to listen to what he has to say before you do anything rash. I think that's the end. I don't know. No, he's talking again. Or he's supposedly talking. But yeah, I actually went through the whole game thinking Esbern was mute. So I was really confused. And I also got a bit misguided by my friend. He forgot who Esbern was, and he ac I asked him if he actually was mute, and he said yeah. But, <laughs> oh well. Main menu again. Yes. So, I mean, this is just what you're going to keep on doing, pretty much, until the peace treaty is over. I know it kind of gets annoying after a while, but I mean, at least you'll be able to progress through the story. And this time, I think, will be the end. I'm not sure. I forgot. I did this, like, right as I was going to bed last night, so I just kind of stumbled upon it. I don't really know how. Food. Just keep on doing this, and uh, that should be it. really hope you guys can see this because I mean I know my iPhone is a bit far away but still I mean that would be a pretty BS uh, <laughs> fix if you can't even see what you're supposed to do um, Shut up yet or no? Obviously not. Like I said, this really does get tedious. I mean, because you don't know if he's done talking yet or. I mean, I'm just kind of randomly winging it right now, but just to pretty much show you what you're going to do. But. I'm pretty sure this is when he's done talking because Alan Wen is talking and I'm pretty sure that was the last time he was talking. I kinda, I, I'm pretty sure I made a mental note that when Alan, when Alan Wen was talking, that's when you're done. Then. I'll 
involved with his death. We want compensation for the massacre at Cart Placement. You slaughtered the very people you claim to be fighting for. True sons of Skyrim would never do such a thing. Tell the Imperial lies. My men would never stoop to such methods, even in retaliation for your butchery at... All the blood spilled in this war is on your head. You've been even-handed so far. What do you say to our demand? Uh, I say... He should compensate well you. For once you'll actually pay for your crimes. I suppose that's the fairest deal we're likely to get. So yeah, this is just Yep. So there you go. Uh rate, I guess, comment if you want, and subscribe. I guess I don't really care because no one really watches my channel anyway. But um, if you have anything else that you want me to do, I guess I could try it someday. Just kind of message me or put it in the comments or something. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do it. Oh no, sorry. Oh. Is Burton going to talk again? No? Okay. I think I can cut it off here. I mean, I mean, uh, if it, if Esburn starts talking again, just do the thing again. Just save it, load it from the main menu, and if he does it again, just keep on doing it. So, yep, thanks for watching. Peace out.